Gonna build a mountain from a little hill. Hey guys, and thank you so much for tuning in to my channel. We have news! The beta gameplay trailer has just been released and I'm really excited to show you guys because there are new animals again confirmed in this trailer so I'm really excited. Let's just first look at the trailer and then we're gonna dive into it so then we can see everything that we can find on all the screenshots and stuff. It's super excited so without further ado, let's just watch this trailer. Okay, so this trailer is just incredible. I love it and I can't wait to start playing with the beta. It's gonna be super excited. So yeah, we definitely need to look at all these shots because this is just really incredible. Like the face of this mandrel, I absolutely love it. It's so good. It's so well made. I love it. And the environment here is just really incredible. We've seen all the building themes and stuff already, so that's nothing new as far as I can tell right now. So let's just move to the next shot. That is the snow leopard. Also, nothing really new to tell, but this could be a baby leopard, but it's too far away. I wish we could see it more. The Indian rhino, we have seen it, and it just looks beautiful. I love it when it rains, and it's just so gorgeous on the skin of the animals. It's really beautiful. So then we have the Bengal tiger. Tiger also just a really beautiful shot but nothing new as far as I can tell then we got some shots of this map and the warthog I think we've seen it a lot during the live stream I don't think there's anything new except for maybe this sign which is now filled but I'm not sure if that already was during our live stream and other than that, I don't really think there's anything new on this shot. So let's just move a little bit further. Of course, the, this is like the mating in Planet Zoo. So when they rub their faces against each other, that's super cute. And this is like the mating in Planet Zoo. So I really like that they have some kind of animation. <laughs> it's really adorable. And then we have a screaming warthog right over here. Some babies over here. Some toys to play with. But other than that, nothing new. I do like the shelter a lot, it looks really cool, but nothing really new as far as I can tell. And then we have a vet running around, and we have an ostrich coming into the habitat, and some babies over here, which we already see too, a lot of toys, and nothing really new in this screenshot either. So let's just move forward. And this is really interesting. This is changing to, these are all terrariums, and I really like that. I'm really curious what this is. These look like terrariums, but they are like too high, so I don't really see any people looking into it. So I'm really curious what that is. Is that just for the trailer just to add terrariums on top of it? Because that would be really weird. Or would this mean that you have like bigger sized ones? I don't really see any path on the other side, so I'm really curious what this 
means. Maybe they just added the terrariums for some decoration so that there are no animals inside of it. I honestly have no idea. I'm really curious what this is, what this means. Other than that, I don't see anything new in this screenshot. And then it changes to this lovely area. I love that elephant statue. It's really cool. I love the detailing with the glass and stuff. It looks really awesome. And there are a lot of awesome decoration items over here of the Indian theme. I love it. It's really good. Other than that, I don't see anything new. So let's move forward. Then we have again a different shot right over here. Just some new building items, but nothing new or anything. So let's move to the next one. And now we have like a really oh, like that Indian pea fowl statue. That is really beautiful. And I love these colorings. That's really beautiful. And this glass. It's almost a bit like stained glass, but then without the color, but I love these details on it. It looks really good. And then, oh, just look at her clothes. We can even give them different clothes. I love that, like fit in the continent. I don't think we have ever seen that in other screenshots. So you can really give your staff members different clothes for different themes. That is something I really love. Thank you so much. I absolutely like this new feature. I love Love it. And then you have some decoration items right over here. Amazing. Really amazing. We can't really tell what's in here. I'm like curious if there are any new animals inside of this terrarium. That would be really cool, but I don't think we can tell from here. And then we have the yellow anaconda right over here, which is really awesome that you can have more anacondas or more terrarium animals in one terrarium. So I really like that feature. Other than that, some decorations right over here. And there are some cars right over here. I'm curious. I don't think we can use them. It's more decoration proposed, but I would love to see that like being really used with like some kind of vendor selling items on there, but oh, that would be really amazing though. <laughs> and then we have the protesters right over here with some awesome signs. I really like that. So they're not happy with how they, well, I'm not really sure if they have signs on it with the animals they are protesting for, or that is just more random. Like I don't, I'm not really sure because it looks like this is also giraffe one maybe I'm not sure but that would be really cool i love this poster by the way too and this one i already seen in my behind closed doors recordings it's really neat i love it would be really awesome if you have like cars and stuff to put inside of your enclosure where like lines for example just lay on that would be really cool and here we have the vet in action i think this is a pronghorn and yeah he's just making sure the pronghorn being cured or researched i have no idea what he's doing but yeah it's really awesome. I just love the detailing in this footage. It's really awesome. And we have the Indian rhino right over here. Uh, <laughs> this animation is really funny, by the way, of this zookeeper. Like, oh, shoot, it happened again. It's really funny. I love that. I love these trees. I love the roots. It's really neat. And oh, finally, this should be the Indian elephant, right? I love it. It's so good. And we have, oh, they're even better babies in the background of the Indian elephant. I love it. We have been recording behind closed doors and these Indian elephants were in our recordings, but we just didn't see them and they didn't show them to us. And we were like, no. And then I was watching Corellis' footage and then I saw them in the distance and he didn't go close to them. But I felt so dumb that we were recording behind closed doors and we didn't see them. Oh my goodness. But look how small these babies are. They are absolutely adorable. I love it. And I love these building items too with the wood. That is really neat. I love how that looks. The textures are really good. And with the vines over here. Yeah, this is really awesome. Oh, that baby is so adorable over here. I just, ah, oh, I love it. I love it. It's so good. And then we have the Garyol guys. Look at the Garyol babies. They're so small. And there's one over here swimming in the water too. They're so adorable. I love it. And the textures on the Garyol are just so stunning. And then we see the babies right over here too. They're so small. 
They're so cute. I really didn't expect them to be so super small. I love it. It looks so good. And all these plants and flowers. Uh, it looks absolutely stunning. And these vines, they look really good too. And here's a baby too. I wonder if that baby is a little bit bigger than the others. It looks like it, which would be really cool, saying it will be a little bit older. I think it is. I think it is. If you look at the size of his body right over here, Oh, I love this game. I definitely love this game. And over here we have the Oryx, which is a new animal that we haven't seen yet in a screenshot or a video. We did see the Oryx in the art piece of Planet Zoo really far in the distance. So yeah, we did kind of see that they would probably be coming into Planet Zoo, but yeah, we just had to wait and see if the RPs were true or not. So yeah, the Oryx is coming to Planet Zoo, which is really awesome. I really love it. It's such a beautiful animal. Really amazing. Look at the body and look at it run and oh, it's so beautiful. And here we have the probably the Cape Buffalo. If it's not, please do let me know, but I think this is the Cape Buffalo and it looks absolutely stunning. I love it. It's so gorgeous and like so big and heavy and that nose and how it shimmers. I love it. And this is the Himalayan brown bear, I think, which is which we have seen and oh, the Indian elephants again and look at the baby sky. Look at the baby swim in the back. They're so pretty, so cute. I love it. And these trees with the flowers, that is just so stunning. Oh, wow. And here are some stumps, I think. Oh, and here there is a really nice bush. And oh, we have seen these in Planet Coaster. I love to play with these. I really like those. Oh my goodness, guys. This is just so amazing. Look at that elephant. It's so good. The animation is so good, I love it. Oh, this is so incredible. And the Indian rhino again. Oh, look at all these baby Gary all swimming in the back. They're so stunning. It's so good. And then uh, we have some baby tapirs, which we already seen, but they're just so freaking cute. I love those tapirs, they're really adorable. And the mandrel, <laughs> that face though, <laughs> that's really funny. <laughs> oh, and this, this animation is so good. Ah, oh, I just love how it just opens its feathers. The Indian peafowl is so beautiful. And over here in the back, we can see like the other building items from the Indian theme. This is really gorgeous. I, oh, I just can't wait to get my hands on it. Only six more days, guys. It's gonna be so incredible. It's gonna be so amazing. I just really can't wait to get my hands on this game. It's gonna be super awesome. Let me know in the comment section what you think of these new footage of Planet Zoo. I'm really excited to read all your comments. And if you haven't seen a live stream yet, we are doing a guessing game. So 10 animals you think we will see in Planet Zoo. Obviously don't include these animals because that will be invalid. <laughs> and guess what three DLCs we maybe can expect. It was a really fun live stream. So thank you everyone who was there. Thank you guys so much for supporting Thank you for my Fae Fan members. My name is The Lady Designer. For those who don't know, please do make sure to subscribe if you're looking for some inspiration, some fun, a lovely community. We're gonna have lots of fun with Planet Zoo, and I just really hope to see you all in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye, guys.